You know me, don't you, Liam? You know my scent. You know my touch. I cradled you nearly the entire time you were in my belly. <laughs> like this. I know that you could feel me then. And I believe that you can feel me now too. You have to know that your mommy is here with you. And your tiny little heart. You have to know that you are not alone in the world, Liam. Mommy's here. If you want some company, that depends. Are you here to tell me that I'm being selfish for not wanting to let my baby die? <laughs> no, I would. I would never say that. I know how difficult it is to lose some someone you love. I understand if you want me to get lost. I, I just thought maybe you want someone to be with you. He really is beautiful. I really hope that he knows I'm here. Yeah, I'm sure he does. Love's powerful. I saw that in my last my days of my dad's life. I see. All right, my dad didn't go through what Liam's going through. As a matter of fact, I just want to say that naming him Liam Mike was great. My father would love that. It's become a real family name, hasn't it? <laughs> you know, I had a complicated relationship with my father. And I was very grateful that the last couple of years that we, we reconnected. We had a great time and it meant the world to us. But the, the illness was gonna prevail in the end. He accepted it before, uh, before I did, before I could. Um... At least you had that time with him. Yeah. My baby hasn't even opened his eyes and looked at me. He hasn't seen me smile at him or felt me hold him in my arms. I just pray that he recognizes my voice when I tell him that I'm here and that I love him. I don't want to accept this. It's not fair. Other people get get miracles. Why can't he get one? You know, I, I felt the same way about my dad. I wanted, you know, any way out, a miracle, a cure. And when I, uh, I knew that there wasn't going to be one, I had to make the decision, put him on feeding to one of, you know, on a feeding tube or let him go. And it's a, it, it was the decision that I just, I couldn't make, I could not bring myself to do because I had just gotten back together with him and I felt, felt like I was giving up on him. How did you decide? You know, I, uh, I asked myself a question. 
is prolonging my dad's life. The best thing for him? Or am I just afraid to have to deal with the pain? 